guys, this is Nibin Prince and back at you. In this one, I would like to talk about how to smoke weed or marijuana, those who know it by that name, to the new beginners for those who want to have their own experience of smoking marijuana. You, first of all, you have to know the primary reason why you want to smoke marijuana. People might think, okay, it's just a regular drug that's like crack cocaine and the long list of other drugs that are out there on the market. But marijuana is, for, for most people in different communities, take for example in the Rastafarian community, marijuana are seen as a holy sacrament um, in that sense of the word. Many people who used it over a course of time, they use it for their own relaxation, for calming them down, for them to, you know, for them to have a better perspective and things. So many people is under bandwagon by smoking it and um, may not understand the need of them smoking it. So it's not like it's a, your regular cigarette where everybody having a puff and keep moving. I believe wholeheartedly that marijuana or weed is for those who are looking to have different experience, whether it be from a meditative um, standpoint, whether it be where you want to connect with, you know what I mean, the spiritual energies because when you smoke weed, I do believe that you're in a different zone, you're in a different kind of mind state. So you have to bear in mind these factors. The benefit of smoking it is not the same as smoking a cigarette or maybe tobacco because the weed itself is a tool or a vehicle that take you to another realm. And a lot of people, when you, you know, have their own experience with this, they laugh a lot. They can have philosophical conversation in depth, you know. So different things you can experience um, from smoking weed. Some people, you can take them back into when they were a the child and, and reveal certain things that may happen to them when they were a the child. And even maybe into their family as well because it got that I think it got that ability to open up different can of worms like I would call it and give you different experience so to a new to a new beginner who's gonna smoke or have an experience with weed first of all you have to know the purpose why you want to smoke you cannot just say because others are doing it or your friends are doing it or your boyfriend or your girlfriend are doing it so you want to do it you have to have your own reason to want to do it a lot of people who are stressed out these days they get a pop from it and it brings them back down to that calm collective state for those who want to have like I said been inspired like great writers are artists out there will be inspired by smoking it so you can take the good from it it's not just a recreational drug that you get you know you smoke it and it's like you go out there you do stupid stuff I think it is a drug that can aid you into grasp a lot of stuff which are so deem complicated you know what I mean in the mundane sense of the word but like I said you have to know the different grade of marijuana weed that you're gonna you know get your hand in it as well because you have different people that with different things some of them are chemically processed as well so you have to know the commercialized ones which are okay are fit are suitable for smoking because many different ones on the market where you smoke you, you pretty much turn a zombie you know <laughs> or maybe you turn something else but like I say know the grades know the quality that you're after and if you don't know you can ask those professional people in a community who smoke like to to advise you upon which one to smoke because like I said I think when you start smoking that it, it, it is it is a life changing and some many people get addicted to it and um, it kind of start to rule them they're not more in more control than anything else and you, you have to know that it, it also common cravings as well what it be it also common cravings as well it could be take from it maybe you got a sweet tooth so it might intensify that maybe you like, well, obviously the munches is a bonus, you know, for those who may low an appetite, you might have a high appetite to want to eat pretty much every and anything inside the house. So bear in mind those factors as well. But like I said, marijuana for those who want to have the, the, the experience is, like I said, I'm not here to tell you that you have to do it, but I'm simply saying if you're going to do it, you have to look in the benefits and the reason and the purpose you're smoking it. Because when you smoke it, it like I said, it's a vehicle. So you have to get into the right mind and tell yourself what you want to get from it. Do you want to get creative with a piece of writing? Do you want to get creative into like business mind as well? Do you want to like, so like I said, um, know the reason why you want to use um, marijuana or weed. I know the purpose that you're smoking it as well because like I said, many people take on to the trail of smoking weed without any good purpose and they end up like becoming very addictive and kind of like lost themselves smoking it. But like I said, know your own personal reason. You know, if you think you can 
enhance your life, you know, maybe enhance your mind, your state of being, go for it. But if you think you're not ready for it yet, chill out until you have more research done on your on your path in terms of, of, of you feeling comfortable by using that substance. Because like I said, I think using the substance, a lot of people um, experience great things and a lot of people also experience traumatized events as well. You know, it's, it's not, a, I don't think it's a drug which is gonna get you out there sort of like break people places or you know smash people things it's not like that but i'm simply saying that it can get you in a state where you open up different can of worms for you it's, it show you a different part of you which you've never seen before right you may not be not ready for that it can show you like you know dead ancestors you name it, it can because it open up that kind of universal mind space which you think wasn't there before you know you thought a reason different and people are like damn he's crazy but now you ain't crazy, it's just a fact that you're now into another, it's like you're plugged into another reality. So if you're ready for that reality and that um, life experience, like I said, do the research and like I said, the best people to ask for advice is those who are already smoking already. Because those people, I think, they, are, they can tell the, the, the plus or the minus of it. They can tell the good ones or not the one, because like I said, there are many different grades or different qualities on the market. So be careful, new beginners, of what you choose to buy, who you choose to buy from as well, you know. That's just all I'm saying there. So feel free to thumb up this video, all of those new smokers, and also the veteran in the business, feel free to thumb up on this video and also tell me, or tell us your experience of using marijuana. Would it be your first moment of smoking? Did you laugh a lot? Did you, you know, see things? Did you hear things? And um, did your reasons, are your reason get, you know, I mean, expand? What was it? So share with us here and um, thank you one more time to hang out with um, the Nibin Prince and check out the other videos as well and leave me a comment and a thumb up as well. Thank you very much guys. Peace.